Microsoft Word has some interesting features to do text replacement. You could probably use programming, software programming, to do text replacement. But uh, you could also use scripting, like born shell scripting. But uh, why re reinvent the wheel when you have Microsoft Word or even you have macros on Excel and stuff? So here I have this document. I'll show you. It says delete in between. So I'm going to show you how I'm going to delete between the text, sort of between the text. And uh, it works if you know what the beginning word is and the ending word is, and you're going to use replace. So just press Control H to enable replace. And so by default, it'll load like this. And so. You can use a thing called use wildcards in options. It's kind of confusing. You have to actually click more, and then you can use wildcards. Now with this, if you use the star symbol, it'll just say any any letters after or between it. So let's say I want to select all the text betwe between this line. And I know the beginning is delete and the ending is ending. So I can type in delete and then star will put any characters that are in between ending. Now the key here now is if I replace it with blank it's just going to replace every line with blank. I can keep the ending word by typing ending And now I can replace everything before the word ending. So this tutorial is to show you if, to remove text that's before a word. Hopefully you have a starting point, like I do with here where I have the word delete. And I can replace all. And you can see it removes all the ending, all the text before ending. So you still need to know what the start of the st sentence begins with. And so let me go bring that back. And so let's say I want to keep the beginning word delete. So again, press Control H and put in the word words delete star ending. It's going to choose this whole sentence here, but instead I want to keep the starting word delete. And now just replace all. And you can see it replaces that whole sentence with this. In, but keeping the starting word. So I thought that was pretty nifty. I don't know if other people would think it's nifty.